Look who paid us a visit. New York, it, it, it's just so different. You can't just walk into the bodega, give me a card, and they give you your medicine. And I need my medicine. Ricky, it's not legal here, goddammit. It's Let's not, not it's, this isn't California. How is medicine not legal? It's good for you, it makes you feel good. Sometimes I, I, the food I eat is no good for my stomach. It sells my stomach. I understand that. I understand that. This is why I'm gonna show you this recipe right now. You can put this oil in anything you want. It's fantastic. There's just a few techniques when you're making this thing and you won't be screwing it up. The first step, make sure your pan is on very, very low. That's very important because if it's too high, if it's too if high. You wanna get high, it's gotta be low. Yeah, I exactly. Get it. it doesn't I make get any it. sense, but if your pan's too high, you're gonna burn the herb. You do not wanna burn the herb. And then we're gonna take some oil. You can take veggie oil, canola oil, whatever you want, and pour that into the pan. This is about half a cup, all right? Step two, make sure the stuff is very, very, very ground up. As, as ground up as possible. You can throw it in a food processor or if you have one of these special grinders. Just make sure it's pulverized because the smaller it is, the more you're gonna release. Just pour it right into your oil when it's all ground up. Give it a little stir with a wooden spoon. Oh yeah, baby. Mikey, how long are we looking before we can, you know, get a hold of this stuff? So once once the herb is in there, Ricky, it's gonna take about 20 or 30 minutes. You know, you gotta be patient here. You really gotta extract the good stuff out of the herb, all right? Every few minutes, give it a stir. Make sure it's not burning. If you start seeing it browning too much, bad sign. Turn it down or even turn it off for a second. You can bake with it, you can get baked with it, you can do all kinds of stuff. It's gonna be amazing. Yeah, pretty much anything. It's always good to just have a bottle hanging around, you know, that's what we like. It's a do. bottle of fresh herb oil. It's been about 20 or 30 minutes, and Mike says that's all we need to make the magic potion. I'm smelling it, I feel like I'm already yeah. all kinds of screwed up just like being in here. If you can see in there, the the herb has changed color. It's a it's a darker tone. It's it's got a nice brownish color. That means it's been extracted into the oil. That's a good sign. The next step, the herb has been extracted into the oil. You got to strain it. Make sure you strain it into something glass or something metal because if you do it into plastic, it will melt. We've all been there before. Yeah. No plastic. The only thing that's going to be melting is my brain after I take some of this oil. I, I swear, Mike, I am, I am screwed up just like being in the same room as this stuff. So be careful here. Will you hold that for me, Rick? I think that's how you know when you it's done. You can use any strainer you have. Coffee strainers work great. Oh, God, yeah. Once you strain it off, just make sure you really push out the herb because there's still some extracted oil that's going to be left behind. Push it down in there. Make sure you get it nice and good. It's dripping. See that? All that extra stuff. You don't want to waste that. That's like one session. Look what we're left with. We have like a brownish green substance. It just looks potent. When it looks dangerous, that's a good sign. Oh no. Cheers, buddy. Ricky, if you, you drink that- wine? Take a shot of this stuff. No, don't take a shot of this stuff. It's super <laughs> hot. Ricky almost killed himself. You idiot. So now what you have is you've got the magic, special, medicinal, perfect, brilliant teaching of life <laughs> segment you, that will heal. Oh, Ricky's already got himself in this. <laughs> it's gonna be incredible. You can put this in your baked goods and you'll get baked. I mean, how often can you eat a baked good and get baked? How often? 